Um, well, congratulations on the film. You know, a lot of it is about uh, somebody being the right person on paper, but not necessarily the right person in life. Have you ever had a relationship like that? Yeah. Everyone but my husband, pretty much. <laughs> <laughs> no, there were, I was pretty discriminating, and I went out with some decent guys. But, uh, you know, were we meant to be together for a long time? I guess not. Well, you know, Sarah's character in the film is in the bubble. Um, how do you help her get out of that bubble and pop it and, you know, get with Leo's character? <laughs> uh, well, I think I help her in spite of myself. I think I'm a pretty much a, pretty much a very selfish mother. Uh, not that helpful normally. But uh, in spite of all my wrongness, I do the right thing and help this strange, young, lovely young man. Um, Win her over. Here's how you throw football. For the first time, I just knew. You want to get a coffee sometime? This is my wedding. We all have baggage. If I were 20 years younger, I'd do you. That is the nicest thing the mother of anyone I've loved has ever said. And what is it about his character that you, you know, instantly connect with? Uh, I'm not sure it's all for the right reasons. Again, it's, it's, sometimes I think you can do the right thing even though you have no good intentions. Yeah. And uh, I think that probably the case with my character. Really, I'm just seeing a cute young guy who's going to break up this marriage uh, to this rich guy. My daughter's married this rich guy, and I don't like rich people, and I don't think he's suffered enough in his life, and I don't think he knows anything, and I don't want him. I don't even know the guy. Yeah. Which is pretty creepy, really. In real life, that's creepy. But in spite of all that, I do help this young man who is the right guy, according to this movie, the right guy for my daughter. According to this movie. Yeah. <laughs> Thanks so much. Appreciate it. Oh, thank you.